Thanks, Ben. Ato usuk niku kapa? Mhm. Ah, nice. Nice. Thanks, Ben. Mhm. Malgana niki bang. Okay. Welcome to AFAX number one stop for entertainment and trending news. Now, Kenyan lady content creator on TikTok by the name Sue. I believe it's Sue or Sue. And as you can see, it is at Sue Winner on TikTok. And she has been posting content basically catering to her man, her husband, Yani. She is the real version of Kumdekeza Monamme. She does not just fix his meal fixes his tie before he leaves the house she also brushes his shoes help him put on his shoes his socks and all that as you can see from these photos i just want to show you a little bit of what happens but she has actually sparked a debate online let's just say men are very happy and saying that this is what a wife should be doing and then there are women who say nijikute Kwani hana mkono ajibrashi vyatu yake ajivalishe socks and there are those who are just admiring this love and saying if this is what marriage looks like then this is what I want. You know, let's just have a snippet of what she does. No excuses. Did you prepare your man for work today? What does Psalm 31 say? Uh huh. <laughs> 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 Okay. 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 Watch him give you so cup and younger, Lucy. Don't go to Naruja and Bruno pick any baby. Take it when you're a beer. You're not a fickle condemn. 
Ah, sabe, but I'm good. And so if you want to catch up with more of this, you can follow her TikTok. But I think you get the idea of what she basically does. Prepare him for work in the morning, make his breakfast, uh, polish his shoes, help him put on his shoes. Of course, when he comes back home, you can see there's a meal being prepared already and at the same time she's soaking his feet of course she has also shared some videos of giving him foot rubs and all that and so i wanted to dive to what netizens are saying because some are really really pressed and i don't know guys if you are a man is this what you would like your woman to do for you is this what is called the ultimate submission and if you're a woman do you see yourself doing this for your man and so i've seen a couple of comments there are women who are saying this is something that they can do if the man is providing well ensuring that you're okay you're not doing anything besides catering for him basi mfuko lazima ito Okay, let's just dive in and see what netizens are saying. So someone says, my husband, my husband, my husband, my husband, nyef, nyef. Somebody says, just followed you today and I'm already tired. So clearly, they're already tired with all this my husband thing. Somebody also says, nimejaribu kuitana my husband, atasiku hajaisha, karibu nijipate, I see you. <laughs> Unapaki your lunch hivyo, anenda kuikula na office girlfriend, tawe. He's in Bwembwe, niza mwaka ya kwanza, give them two years, atachoka kuosha, hiyo migu. Somebody else says here, office girlfriend be like, babe, leo ametuwekea nini? And uh, somebody also says, acha ni kuambea ukilala ukiamka ni habi, man akikuwacha utakufa na pressure. We, wadao, sito boy, the ego in me, nah. And somebody also says here, mademo Nairobi wakiona hivi, wanaona kichwa ineza ruka. <laughs> and there were so many comments of people referencing women from Nairobi, women from town. This is something that they would never do. Somebody also says, everything revolves around your husband. You housewife in this era, girl, stop. And somebody also says, bitter women are all over your comments saying, it can't be them. Treating and be submissive to your man is not slavery as most Kenya ladies think. So this is somebody who is putting out clearly that this is submission. But it does not mean that you're a slave to a man doing this for him. Can never be me. Mwanaume hata umfanye nini ata kucheza tu. Anyway, best of luck, sister. Somebody says, hivyo unaosha mbabazu wako, je pia wewe huoshwa afadhali nyinyi muna pendana. And somebody else says here, unamprepare kuenda kuchit. And uh, these were some of the sentiments that netizens were saying, that you can do all this for a man, but still, he will find somebody else out there who doesn't do these things and even leave you for her. So is it really worth it and somebody also says here those things she will tire my mom has been doing it for half a century so this is somebody who has seen this work and their own mother has been doing it and she finds no problem at all with it and somebody also says here unamvalisha socks kwa ni nikilema and uh, they continue to say wewe umewekwa kwa chupa so there's so many people who don't see themselves helping their man put on their socks is he handicapped can he not do it himself so this is something that they don't see themselves doing and let's just go through one last one somebody says men that get treated like this respect their women and are a hundred percent providers that's why a woman will be submissive nyinyi wengine wa 50-50 kila mtu aoshe migu yake kubaf so this is somebody who believes that this can work so long as the man is doing it all a hundred percent then you will get this kind of treatment a woman who is submitting a hundred percent and you need to be providing a hundred percent as well so basically it's what i told you before what people are saying mfuko lazima itoboke do what you're supposed to do as a man and you will be getting this same treatment anyway guys i don't know what to think about this do you feel that this is um slavery as some people are saying it this is not submission do you see yourself doing this for your man and do you strongly believe what some people are saying that if you do all this it doesn't matter at umoshe mgu umlishe ufanya all these things still he will find somebody else out there he will still cheat and of course there are those who believe that so long as you do this a man will love you and provide a hundred percent everything so submission to this level 
actually does work well leave your thoughts in the comment section down below i'm really um looking forward to hear what your thoughts are on this but that's what's happening on the internet streets don't forget to subscribe turn on your post notification flow if accessible on instagram as well if you haven't and i'll see you on the next one bye bye